Yo, so we are back into rank seasons today. Gonna try it out, see how it goes. Got the God Squad here. I think I might use maybe Kershaw on the mound today. I haven't really decided. Mickey Mantle, I am three hits away. Three hits away from prestiging this card. So we really want to try to have a three hit ball game. Probably going to use Kershaw or Nolan Ryan. I haven't decided yet, but you guys will see here in just a second. If you guys want to see more ranked seasons, let's hit 100 or more likes on this video. Subscribe to the channel if you are not already. And in the comment section below, let me know if there's anybody you think I should replace and try out for any of these positions. Maybe take off the team, put them on the bench, and put somebody else in at the starting position for any of these guys. But this is the team, the God Squad. We're hopping into ranked seasons. Going to try to have a good day today i decided to put mickey mantle lead off just so we could have as many up as as possible we're facing carrie wood look at that mickey man look at that yo the first three hitters are the same i don't think i've ever had that happen uh then horns v seager randy created player carrie wood eighth jose ramirez ninth wow let's go mickey come on it's out of here oh we are two hits away now from prestiging mickey mantle i really hope we can do it today oh man i need that i i know it's almost MLB 21, right, but I've been trying to prestige this car for so long, and I just, I, I am so close, and I, I need to get it done. Ball four to Tatis, following the home run, we get a walk. I would love to play well today. I've been struggling recently in ranked seasons, can't seem to get base hits and runs across and everything, and I would love for that to change today. Three into the Griffey, ball four. Good eye. Good eye. G double O D E Y E. Good eye. Good eye. Good eye. Mike Trout coming up two on. Nobody down. Looking to do some damage. Nearly 400 average with this card. I would love to get it up to 400 today. I suck. One and oh, and I'm doing that. What is wrong with me? I'm like a jar of pickles left out too long. Oh, no. Yeah, that's caught. Hanging away too long. Two and two to Chipper. Now there's two down in the inning. Two on. This is uh, not what I wanted. When we had two on, nobody down. I didn't want a fly out, a pop out, and a pop out. But at least we got one run. Mickey Mantle, two hits away from being prestiged. And it's a one, two, three inning for Nolan and Ryan. Pretty good. Baby Ruth, take him to the candy shop. No doubt about it. Solo home run. I, I, yeah, I'm replaying this. That one was destroyed. I got to see the distance. I'm thinking in MLB 21, I'm going to replay every time I get a no doubt home run. Just I would replay all of them, but I feel like that's a little toxic. But 490. Oh, my God. That's close. I'm rounding up to 500. That's a 500-foot homer from Babe Ruth. You know, if that hill weren't there out there, that would have been a 500-foot home run. I don't know if this is a no-doubter, okay? It's either a no-doubter or Pudge is like, come on! <laughs> I'm replaying it either way, and we'll see what he did, but it's either a no-doubter or he's waving it like that. Okay, he's waving it like that. Well, I guess like that, you know, because this will be waving a foul. I don't know how you guys see it for me with the camera sometimes, but back-to-back -back homers, not bad. I will 100% take that. Last year, I did have a home run with Nolan Ryan, so it'd be cool if he could get one, but I'll take a hit nonetheless. I'm feeling pretty good today. I'm hoping we can get some more runs. Mickey Mantle coming up. Two hits away from being prestiged. No, drop, please. Oh, man. If I had the PCI a little bit to the right, would have been, I think, home run number two and hit number two. Still two hits away from prestiging. No, 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 no. I didn't strike out. Y'all did not see that. Come on, get through. Nah, Griffey not able to get it. Through the hole. Wow. Now... I'm stupid because I'm only throwing fastballs, but my opponent has not had a timing on a fastball that was not, like, very late or too late the entire game, I don't think. And so I'm just throwing fastballs because he can't catch up to them, and then all of a sudden, I think he realized what I was doing and is ready for that inside 102-mile-an-hour fastball. But, yeah, so it's on me, but there's good reason for it, okay? There was a reason I was throwing that pitch where I did. He, he, he wasn't able to time it up, and then all of a sudden he is... And uh, our lead's cut to two. All right. Three and two count. We give up a base hit. I don't want to pitch myself out of a win today. Striking out Kerry Wood. Not ready for the circle change. Oh, wow. That's a hit. Okay, that's fine. 
I just need to because, you know, I personally am like, okay, that's maybe a lucky hit. We got him chasing a little bit late on the inside sinker. And I a lot of times give up home runs or big innings after stuff like that. See, I just gave up a hit. And now two back-to-back -back hits. Nolan Ryan's confidence is going down a little bit. So I really need to focus up and just not let anything happen from this inning because it seems like the biggest innings I give up always come after something like that first hit of the inning where I start to maybe get a little bit frustrated and things just then seem to spiral out of control for me. And I really need that to not happen right now. Randy Arozarena, 2-0 count to him. I think it's pretty much just for me now pitching around him and if I walk him, I walk him. I'm uh, going to do a little bit of a mound visit, I think, if we do walk him. Perfect. No nope, bad, terrible, man. I thought it was perfect, and it was way more inside than I wanted it. Now we got to face a creative player, so let's do a mound visit. Let's just warm up the bullpen a little bit just in case. Raleigh Fingers, Zach Britton, sure. Why not? Looking for a double play here. Let's go, striking him out. Oh, my God, that's a huge strikeout. Carry one now. I would not be surprised at all if we saw a pinch hitter here. I think there was a one, two, three, top of the third, bottom of the third, top of the fourth inning, and I was thinking we were going to get one easily in the fourth, and then that hit happened, and then y'all know the rest. Bases are loaded for Larry Walker, looking for an out. No way that scores. Diamond fielding from Pudgy. I was going to say, if that allows a run to score with 70 speed, diamond fielding, I was going to be a little bit pissed off, but hey, it's okay. Mickey Mantle coming up. Two hits from prestiging this card. We got to do it. We got to get a base hit. I've been sucking ever since the first two innings. I mean, I only have four hits in this game, so it's not like I was doing amazing, but I started off pretty well, and then we fell apart. I don't know what happened. Garrett Croquet coming into pitch. I suck against this dude. I suck against pretty much anybody through who throws gas, which is a lot of the cars this year. I suck against either anyone who throws gas or sinkers. And it seems like they do one or the other or both this year. And it's been a tough time for me in ranked seasons. Mickey Mantle looking for a hit. Ooh, Mickey Mantle getting a hit, but not for us. That's so sad. Two down here, bottom of the fifth inning. Mickey Mantle on first. Hung that sinker a little bit. I'm having a tough time with uh, with Nolan Ryan getting his control down. I think this card has pretty low control. Uh, yeah, 75. So it's it's not as low as I thought, but uh, you know, I I just I'm I'm having a hard time getting pitches with him to go where I want him to. Chipper Jones, Gold Glove defense over there at third base. After five, it's three to one. I don't feel comfortable for the rest of this game with a two run lead, especially. Uh, with how my pitching seems to have been going. Like, I feel like I started off really well. It's going down a little bit. Hitting started off well, going down a little bit. And you would think it would be the other way around, right? Like, you get better as the game goes on. My first game of the day, so maybe I'm a little rusty to start. I get better warmed up as the game goes on. But it seems to be the opposite for me today. I guess maybe it's opposite day today. So we face Kerry Wood. We face Garrett Croquet, Crotchet. And now we're facing Raleigh Fingers. Let's try to get some hits. Let's try to get Mickey Mantle up again. That's my goal right now, which I want to get Mickey Mantle as many as bats as I can. And getting hits, getting runners, walks, whatever it is, is the way to get him up again. Look at that. Mike Trout, one pitch, one hit. That's what we need to do. Let's get two pitches, two hits, three, three, four, 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 four. four. Shout out to Wendy's, my favorite fast food. Hey, ball four to Chipper, 3-0, so I closed my eyes, and we draw a walk. Oh, baby, Rogers Hornsby. I was literally about to say, no matter what happened, I suck with this card. He just has a noodle for me, right? I get good PCI, good timing, and it just dies. But I'm glad we're able to get a base hit there. Babe Ruth looking for his second homer of the game. I would love a no-doubt pop a slam, take him to the candy shop. That's what we need. And I strike out. 3-0. 3-0 to Babe. And I strike out. Oh, my God. I don't deserve to win this game. 3-0 and to Babe Ruth, and then I end up striking out. What the heck is wrong with me? I'm garbage. I'm, I'm a trash can. I'm a trash can. I'm literal garbage. And Pudge comes through. Okay, there we go. I needed that. I really did. Uh, I'm going to stop the runner a second in case he throws the third. Look what he did. He threw the third. Now we got to keep trying to get Mickey Mantle up, though, because I need hits with Mickey Mantle and now Billy Wagner comes in don't tell me it's 99 Billy Wagner I don't think it is for some reason I want to say 99 Billy has a change up uh let's see 
Okay, yeah, so this is the 94 version. Still a good card. I still suck against this card. You know, he throws, I'm pretty sure, 100, but at least it's not the 99 one. And hit and run from Billy Wagner. Not Billy Wagner, Nolan Ryan. <gasps> oh my god, he just got screwed with no animation. Yo, that's a basis clearing hit and run to RBI double from Nolan Ryan. Oh my god, Mickey Mantle coming up. Looking for a second hit of the game again. Two hits away from prestige in this card. We really need to try to come through here. And Mickey Mantle gets his second hit of the game. His second homer of the game. We are one hit away from prestiging Mickey Mantle. It's a no-doubter, so I'm going to replay it. Beautiful. Mickey, I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. Have my children. Look at the bat flip. 420. 399 wow uh, yeah i mean i didn't think it was super far but i thought maybe over 400 if he's no doubting it oh my god that one felt amazing ken griffey jr is it a solo shot it is line drive dead center field home run from griffey perfect perfect oh my god let's go man that's awesome also, if you guys are watching this video right now, y'all some real MVPs, please leave me your thoughts on this down in the comment section. Uh, it's not a thing, right? If you get a perfect perfect, it's not a hit 100% of the time. I am in the crowd with the willingness to be convinced and have my mind changed, but I am in the crowd where I kind of would like it if perfect perfects were a hit 100% of the time. Now, my reasoning is... If I do something perfectly, I feel like I should be rewarded for it 100% of the time. If I green a shot in 2K, I feel like I should be rewarded for it 100% of the time. And here's my thing, right? Yeah, that might cause really good players to get hits more often and stuff. But how many times realistically do y'all think you get a perfect perfect in a game? For me... It's, it's probably a handful of times, usually less. Usually like one or two times per game. I know I've gotten, I think, three in a row or something now. Um, but hear me out, okay? I feel like for me and my experience, I don't give up that many perfects and I don't give up or, or, or I don't get that many perfects a game. Now, with that being said, I personally think if perfect perfects were going to be a hit 100% of the time, you would have to cut back on other types of hits, right? Uh, you would have to probably make it so good good uh, is maybe a little bit less and, and, and stuff like that. But I don't know. That's just I'm interested to see if anyone has thoughts on it because I do think it's okay where it's at now. But I also think it's extremely frustrating when you can hit the ball perfectly and not get a hit when you know maybe in the same game and i understand that's baseball right like a very late very early stuff might go for a hit in the exact same game but i understand that is baseball it does happen but again this is a video game this is not real life uh this is not going to be a perfect sim and for online gameplay right it could be different offline for online gameplay i would like to see the user skill be king and key and whatever but that's just my opinion again i'm, I'm open to having my mind changed and seeing what people have to say but yeah, that, that's pretty much all I have to say. We're one out away from a mercy rule. One out away from a mercy rule. Babe Ruth with a 500-foot homer. Mickey Mansell almost had one. I, I think he, what, had 480 or whoever that was. It wasn't Mickey Mansell. It was somebody else. But we saw the ball a lot better in that inning. I actually did, I did change something. So I, I changed how my thumb was on the thumbstick. I literally changed how I had my thumb on the thumbstick. And it seemed to work out really well. We are one on away from Mercy Rule in, which is pretty cool. Mickey Mansell, if we do get a Mercy Rule, doesn't get prestiged. But that means he's one hit away. And maybe that could be what we do in our next video. Let's go! Striking him out. Nolan Ryan, complete game. One runner. Oh my god, game called dude. A mercy rule. We are back. Better than ever. Uh, I don't know why I hit this well this game. Um, you know, I struggled for one, two, three innings of it. And then we put up a nine spot. It felt pretty good. I felt like I was doing well. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you had a good time. I had fun. I hope you did too. Like, comment, subscribe. Social medias. All that good stuff. And I will see you next time. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. I'll see you tomorrow.